Hello, everyone. Unmute yourself and talk. You are free to talk now. Unmute yourself and talk. Uman Farouk. Hello. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. How are you? Fine, sir. How was your day? Fine, sir. We thank God. Hope everybody is enjoying a facilitation now. Yes. Beautiful evening, sir. Good evening. How are you? Very fine, sir. Yes. Uh, very quickly, uh, the one we did on Monday, you know that uh, it's a little bit a wasted effort that uh, those uh, those recordings were not. Uh, I didn't record it for you people, and uh, so sorry, so sorry. I don't know what happened. Maybe people. Maybe I get distracted or so. I just don't know because when I get to the suffer, it's not there. And that is why I started uh, this recording early this uh, this evening. Uh, I want to believe everybody is in now. Yes, uh, please, please, uh, just on this note, I want to welcome you for this uh, unrowdy classroom uh, this evening, because if it were before, you would have been here. Maybe uh, because uh, you have talked to yourself, you are now behaving like an adult. I appreciate if you can maintain this throughout the class, and we don't need to... Uh, uh, to start muting ourselves and be saying, hey, keep quiet, shut up, or all these things. Just signify. Once you want to signify, then I will, I will allow you. It's an interactive uh, section. It's a normal classroom. It's not uh, just a... Uh, and I don't expect you to talk when you are not asked to talk. Many people raise up hand. It's only one person that will talk. So... Uh, try and maintain that. Like uh, I used to uh, to start the class we had on Saturday on Monday. I did uh, mention that uh, why do we call uh, this particular class or this uh, National Open University uh, a distance uh, learning institution? And I expected uh, many people to know this uh, because we're all familiar with uh, what we are talking about now. So it's not like we don't know what is open and so like I earlier said, I've told you the definition by saying that uh, uh, open and distance learning is a learning that takes place through the separation of teachers and the students or the instructors or the facilitators or whoever and the learners. So even by, can be by geographic, geographical, can be by uh, space, can be by distance. Like we have in a class now, some of you are not from a, you are not from the same geopolitical zones. And yet, we are having you and we are all here. That was what makes it different. Though it's online class, it's face-to-face, uh, -face, like I would say, face-to-face -face on camera. I cannot get hold of you, but at least we can uh, 
We can chat. We can talk. Everyone that is talking, I can see. Please, I'm not hearing anything. Unmute yourself. In case you call Michael. Till they do. Unmute yourself. You hear me? Because I make sure that uh, everybody's. Uh, Good afternoon, sir. We can hear you, sir. Aha. Uh -huh. So, unless I ask you to uh, mute yourself, that is when you should mute yourself. Please, giving the line freely. Those of you are, that are having your children beside you, kindly engage them with something for this one hour. And uh, I could see that another class crop up uh, after five, uh, five o'clock today. Can we still have it or we have another class? Hello. We can still have it there. Okay, for those that, so we we'll pause for an hour and then we we'll start all over again. Anyway, that is by the way. So, what are we saying about? Uh, what are we talking about? We are talking about uh, introduction of open and distance learning. That is what is open and distance learning. Uh, I, I think uh, for me to enjoy my class, I need to mute. I need to meet some people. I need to meet. I need to meet. I need to meet. Because I can see that uh, some goods, some people are in the village. So their goods are destroyed. Aha. We we had the discussion of uh what is open and distance learning on Monday. I was able to describe the uh the essence of this course, whereby I told you that we are uh, where well, we define what uh, open and distance learning is, what are the characteristics of open and distance learning, identify various stages of uh, learning. So, and which I tried to do last week, but unfortunately it was not recorded. Uh, so, by so doing, I, I will just try to see how fast we can open a distance learning is such an education or a learning platform where teacher and students are separated, even by space, by location, by time. And I have earlier told you that you have five major ways of learning through this platform in National Open University. Some are, uh, whereby in your normal uh, uh, conventional school, you just only one uh, method. So out of these five methods, if you are able to exploit all of them, I see no reason why you should not score A in all your courses. Because by the time we are giving you this lecture, uh, this uh, facilitation, others, some people will so some people see uh go go out there people are waiting and i've asked them to be muted now right to uh, i've allowed them in they should not disturb i'm i've allowed you in everybody should come in come in start joining so like i was saying that you have five major ways of learning. One, the facilitation that we are doing now. Majority of all uh, of us are going through this uh, uh, system. We are, we are learning through this, which is synchronous. That is, on face-to-face, -face, just like uh, when at the same time, at a particular time in your various place. At different place, at different, uh, at different place, the same time, and the same lecture. So, and we are being taught by only one also. So, by so doing, you have that access. There is another one which is a This lecture, you can see how a, a, a recorded thing of just the live class as we are. It will just be like a live class. It's only that uh, your participation will not be felt in the class. But you see how it, and that's the second one. The third one is the discussion forum that you have. Maybe your group, maybe some of you are in uh, biology education, some are in 
science major so my uh, because we have three set of uh uh system in learning in any in any university one you belong to a department two first of all you belong to a university the university you belong to is the largest area. So everybody is a student of the university. Now, when you said you are in the university, in which faculty are you? So whether you are science, whether then from the faculty, it's still brought down to break you down, break it down to which of the faculty, uh, what are you studying? Which is your department? Where your course resided, uh, resides. So those three stages are three stages where you, so what I'm saying in essence is that you can learn through your groups, maybe from your faculty, from your department, and as well as uh, uh, from university, as a, you can choose your group, because as time goes on, when you get to 300 level, all of them, there will be what we call segregation. All of you that gather together now are not likely to see yourself again. Not only see, not see yourself, um, not that they do you part, but you know when the course you don't have uh, course to take a common course like this uh, that binded you together. Three hundred level everybody will go to his department. Anyone that is still in any department or faculty, uh, any faculty or university course at three hundred level, maybe uh, at at the second semester. So by second semester, you should have done with all the uh, all faculty courses. So you face your department, and that's where you're going to finish from. So in other words, what we are saying is that will be the uh, uh, the, uh, the third phase. The first phase, is, the fourth one is the materials you already got in. We have given you materials. So these materials are meant for you uh, to read. You are to read the material ahead of the class uh, classes. As you are getting registered, you have the course. And another one is the materials. Nobody me, I don't have these materials. No, 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 no. If you tell me you don't have the materials, that means you are not you are not electronically inclined. Your studentship to be uh, we should we, we should now say start saying you are not technological inclined at all. You are you are alien to technology because the course materials are already on, on the net. If people from uh, Akonba, other universities in Nigeria can see your course material to read, even as far as uh, uh, overseas. There are some uh, universities in Zimbabwe that are using this uh, course material. So if you have it and you don't utilize it, that means you are not taking advantage of what you have to, in order to learn. So now that takes me to uh, the history of uh, uh, ODL and stages of learning in ODL. Like I told you the other time, I don't know be careful. I don't know be careful. Be careful. Like I told you the other time, I said it started with what we call correspondence education. During correspondence education, what do we have there? It's a, a stage that people were learning through mail, emails, they send materials to you, you reply and you do your assignment or your whatever, your test. Because the, at that stage, at, at the correspondence stage, the, uh, the materials will be loaded alongside with your reading. To finish the reading, you have it in modules, or it's been seg uh, segment. So finish the assignment will follow. Just like you have in your course uh, materials, the course materials you are having, all what you need to read are there. By the time at the end of each modules or each uh, unit, you find an assignment. So in other words, the assignment you are seeing there are what they did there. They used to, and they will send it to their uh, various uh, 
uh, uh, to the various schools, they will mark differently because you are not having it. It's like a dis uh, different uh, uh, distance uh, learning as we are. So at that level, that is where we have what we call correspondence uh, education. So this correspondence education are the one attended by our forefathers, our great uh, educationists, because at that point in time, it was self-study. No one is being assisted. You will read from ed, uh, from uh, open cover to the back cover, and you understand the deep meaning. Because by the time you are asking the question, you ask for yourself, because it's time bound, that within this period of time, you, must, you should be able to finish this textbook or this uh, notebook, and then answer the question they are in. By the time your results come, you will see that whether you get it or not. So you that doesn't know what you are writing, you don't know uh, what uh, the causes. And that is why people of those old were so sound grammatically. Because every word, they need to pronounce and do it correctly. So I will say, uh, I will leave in that correspondence uh, stage, then we move to extramural classes. In that extramural classes, what do we do there? That is early education. There we have where people are gathered. They, they gather uh, people in one in a uh, in a in a place like a, a school, just like what we are doing initially. Those of you that started this uh, that know National Open University in the time past, that's uh, before 2015. Because I would say we started the presentation around 2015 online. Before 2015, what we normally do is we ask you people to look for a second a, a, a facilitation center where you go to those facilitation center to go and listen to lectures, and each lecture has been assigned to you, whereby all of you will be there to have a, we give you what we call a, a education. Then. At that time, at that point in time, you you are you are you are now uh, students under moral uh, studies. So on that, that after that moral studies, then we have our establishment of University of Air. The University of Air is uh, where radio was used, and this is. That is, the sound was involved. We started using sounds to get uh, people uh, uh, to to touch people on uh, different courses. So on radio, but that one again is not having a, a major feedback because it was uh, uh, it, it is a kind of uh, education that uh, you have. Within a in a confined people would now go to uh, the where people are having radio. Those people that doesn't have radio that means cannot listen to it. Not on, on uh, now that uh, we have it on our on our our handset. The students on our set that you can lay your hand upon on and then you can listen to what they are doing. So uh, after that. Uh, level of uh, uh, air radio, then we, we now start of a technological thing, which we are all using now, just like what uh, we are doing now. We are in the age of technological uh, stage. So everyone are now being carried along without making it a life uh, Live broadcast, uh, live teaching. If not for the rowdiness and the uh, people who are not, uh, uh, who, are, who did not allow us to enjoy the class. You know, when you talk to everyone, uh, all of us, I, I believe we all matured, we should do the needful. We should have, know that uh, we want to have this class. Just be, be, for one hour, we should be able to put our house in order. We should be able to keep all that is apart. Give it a chance. 
if it a uh, 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 time to say that okay, this is my quiet time. Let me utilize it. Settle your children. Settle whoever, or tell your uh, tell your husband, or tell your wife. Please help me to handle these children between this uh, period. Let them know. Even a child of, uh, of uh, a a a a day old baby, you can manage the baby within that one hour. Please, if I open the line now for all of us to come in and then uh, make a contribution, we will see how rowdy the whole thing will be. And I don't enjoy it. Mostly, I won't deceive you. I don't enjoy it because if I'm the only one talking, um, that is means it's not uh, the learning is not uh, meant for what it's supposed to be. It's not meant for what it's supposed to be. Dada, you want to say something? Yes, hello. I'm hearing hello? you. Yes, yes, sir. This class is confusing because in our portal, almost every day there is GST 107. I don't know. And I don't know why. I don't know why it's like that. Sir, I, the, I, the, she is saying the, the, he's saying the, the truth. In our portal, GST 107 is everything. Like it's what we are having throughout this week and even the today. next week. So Even I today, don't understand. We're having it four to five no, o'clock, and we're having it five to six again. Hello, uh, yeah. so before you came in, before you before you came in, I found yes, those that came in earlier. I said it. Okay. I said I, I don't know what happened, and I've tried to see them. Even I told you what happened. This lecture I suppose not to repeat it because initially I've taught it on Monday, and I recorded it only to find out that when I got to the uh, uh, the server, I couldn't find it. And these two people reoccurring, seven o'clock, seven o'clock. I didn't fix it for uh, two days. It's only one day I request for. And I don't know why it's like, right, but I will try as much as possible to control it. And then anytime we agree, whichever one that come on, 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 online, on the, uh, on our Podcast. WhatsApp group, or uh, whichever one that comes, Ignore it. Except the one we agree upon. Okay. 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 Sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. So, but I, I will still want us to bear with me, and uh, because we are we are far far behind, and I want us to cover these uh, courses as we want to do. Yes, sir. So, so, if we are to cover it, we need extra class. So, if we can have it out of the eight weeks, we are still, uh, now. If we do this one and then the other one, that makes it to be uh, four, uh, four weeks. We still have four weeks. An exam is starting on 23rd of October. I don't know, or the 2nd of October. I don't know how do, how, how we get, uh, get there. So that means we are not having much time. Yes, I can see some hands up. Yes. Uh, who is talking? Ai Ai Da Musu Enoch. Yes, sir. I'm not talking yet. Richus. <coughs> okay, you are not talking yet. Okay. Yes, sir. Then, you have those of, those, okay. Those of you that raise yes. your hands. Yes, sir. Can I talk? Yes, talk. Yeah, we got into this particular class. I noticed that the I number wait, that wait. You the, the time that we get to us, uh, the last hello, class sir. was five hello, to six. Hello, hello. We have addressed this issue. Don't let us go back to what we have addressed. I've said it clean, clear and clear that we are sorry for bringing yeah. this thing up by this time. It was an initial arrangement was four o'clock. Uh, it was four to five. And I, I said it that even I recall before it's only one uh, only Saturday in the morning that you can call it. It will be recording the, the lectures. And that is why we are having it all the time. Okay, Please. sir. Uh-huh. Let us bear with, with our steps. 
even after this, uh, after this class, if need be, if it is agreed upon, hello, if it is agreed upon, we can still have this class by five to six. We just pause for this. We do have two, uh, two hours a uh, uh, unit course. That is every every course by two uh, uh, two hours. So your own is one hour. So but the one hour, like I said, we are short of time. We didn't start on time. And I told you uh, initially on, uh, on Saturday why it was not started earlier. So let's let's move on. Ajala, you still want to say something? Thank you, sir. What do you want to say? Oh, yeah, talk. What do you want to say? Sorry. Good afternoon, sir. To continue the class. Good afternoon, sir. You found some of my questions, sir. Okay, God bless you. So, then raise up your hand. You've, You've answered, answered my question, question, sir. You've answered uh, the question. Uh, put us, put us, Hello, sir. Put us your hand because you still show that you are. And uh, where you, where you, uh, you press your hand, uh, where you, you raise up your hand, go and put it down there. Come there, I mean. Come there, I mean. Please, uh, let's continue the lecture after the lecture. So, like I was, I was saying, I said, now at, at this stage, we are computer technological stage to this present time. Now, let us look at them one after the other. Uh, the stages, one after the others, and uh, what we have. And uh, so, you can see the corresponding stages started with uh, Sir Pittman's uh, uh, touch your hand uh, through mail, like I've told you what, uh, what informed us. Then, so in other words, it was at that time they are called, uh, they are receiving uh, uh, this thing. Odes, Odes, I won't say, I won't say negative things to you. You people should maintain the decorum now. To maintain the Quran, what is all this? Eh? I, 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 well, I'm not blaming some, some people. They are just seeing uh, technology for the first time. It seems uh, because this will be the first class ever since in the last seven years I've been taking this course. This will be the class that uh, I ever use uh, this kind of words to. Honestly, I taught the previous uh, year, the last year, the upper year, uh -uh. and I don't, I don't like this. All of you just come and then, you, if you cannot control your children or you cannot control your home, then stay away. You will still listen to this um, uh, uh, class after the after this. Please don't let me insult you. The whole world is watching you. We don't need to continue like this. We are explaining something that may, after all, by the, uh, 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 upon all this, some of you will still, uh, will, will still score zero. I would say um, uh, National University is not a good school because you don't have any, uh, you don't have contact with lecturers that you want to go and bribe. Is these people that will be looking for uh, uh, for area of concentration? Ah, please, let us maintain the coral. I don't like it. We are adults. I don't think any uh, six, six years old uh, child is coming here to uh, to do all this. I'm teaching other courses. I'm teaching uh, not only your class alone. But I'm not enjoying this class. I must say it to you. So, Adios, what do you want? Like I, like I said, that uh, this uh, time of uh, the pe that period was the period where our fathers and our grandfathers, great grandfathers, people like Aulowo, Zeke, uh, Fabio Balola, and the likes. That was when they had their degree. And the degree then is based on the uh, uh, University of London, or uh, uh, Cambridge University, or Oxford University. So all these people are coming in different manner. Just like you have the investor of Lagos, you have the investor of Ibadan, you have you. So they are everybody is doing their own. But some people are when you hear them, ah, I passed my Cambridge, ah, hallelujah. 
So they will jubilate because they have done well and they, they are now a graduate. Some will say, ah, I've found the Oxford University. Ah, because they are the one that communize us. And so we're so engrossed with the kind of education we are giving. And during that time, it is May that we received then. So during the time uh, we start saying uh, this thing, uh, sound and video stages, well, that was uh, after the World War, then we started having university extension, whereby people are having extramural classes, just like I said. Then at a later day, we, uh, the use of radio, uh, which in Nigeria then it was, uh, uh, the radio was used, uh, I think, uh, in, in Saria, Amadou Bello University, Saria, where we have uh, uh, air, uh, air radio to teach teachers. We are, they were used to teach uh, teachers there. Those, uh, the te those teachers who are meant to teach uh, people from uh, uh, those that have probably one certificate or the other, they, they need to uh, give a uh, teaching to others is in form of uh, methodology for them to, uh, to to give to people. So when we look at it, uh, the uh, open and distance uh, in Nigeria is more or less uh, a stage that it grows to this uh, level we are. Uh, if, uh, the use of radio, then followed by the use of television. You, uh, you can now see, mainly the use of radio started again when uh, in early 70s or late 70s downward, where people will be taken to studio. It was not, uh, don't just uh, to receive and then give back, but it's not to talk, then no, no, only the teacher can talk. Yeah, yeah, but they took a uh, rich children there, you don't know whether they are, when we started using uh, television, the television only showed those children and they'll be asking questions from themselves. They'll be asking questions from themselves. And at that level, uh, it is in-house, not exposure to these levels that we have now. So in other words, we'll say the history of, uh, of, of open and distance learning is into two uh, levels. We have the first stage as learning at globally. So, and you know, we have it, the first open university, the open university started in 69 as a public distance learning and research uh, university. We have started again. Then we have a United Kingdom Open University led to the establishment of open universities around the world. And that was, I uh, think, uh, is one of the olden, um, olden days one. There are 41 other distance learning tertiary institutions in Asia, out of which five are private owned uh, institutions. So, Let us now look at it around the world. Okay. Boston, uh, University of Southern Queensland, and University of Liverpool, among the world. So here in Nigeria, uh, it was during that, uh, in 1977, when they wanted to start uh, this thing, uh, election, before the election in uh, that come up in 1978, to that, uh, 1979, when Chagari became president, they have been agitating to put it into uh, incorporation with Yaba College of uh, Higher Education because it's the first higher institution in Nigeria. Then people were, maybe, uh, most, most, most of you have heard about PWD. PWD is people. Works department. 
those engineers that are working there and those people that are working there are once a teacher. They are the one giving education because they went to school at Farah Bay. And there are schools that we are talking about in Syria alone. That was the for mainly for education. But other uh other courses is being done in Yabat uh, Yabatek, they call it uh, I, uh, Yab, uh, Yaba Aya College. So that is where people who started having uh, their education and then you get to school. But before then, University of Oxford, extra moral classes was established in University of Ibadan. I've talked about that, whereby people register as corresponding candidates for BTGC and A-level. So from there, they started having uh, their education uh, all along. So the first air radio, the one I mentioned, was at Amadou Bello University, where the, uh, the first employee, uh, uh, where the open and distance learning was first employed, mainly for teachers then, so that people who are not in a, uh, they, they produce teachers for schools who can go and teach at schools. And that is why the open radio was given to them. And the system that set up a, a Nigerian force was conceived in 90, yes, I said it, said it the earlier on. So uh, when you look at the establishment of open and distance learning, they have started again. When you look at the uh, the policy that op uh, that established the open and distance learning, it was uh, brought out from a Chagari regime in 1979 that let us have what we call open and distance uh, open uh, open university. And during that time, they tried to establish it majorly in Abuja, that because it's more or less uh, closer to nearly every, uh, every state. So by so doing, it was trying to establish, uh, they were trying to establish it for, uh, during that time. And in 1983, it was truncated by uh, the administration. The reason being uh, is best known to them. And that is why we, when they said that uh, the first, they are, this question might look confusing. When they said the first uh, uh, National Open University, the first Vice Chancellor of National Open University is who? Some people miss it. Some will say, uh, Professor Ugberu Jagede, no. Ugberu Jagede is not the first vice chancellor of National uh, Nigerian Open University. Is a uh, first vice chancellor of National Open University of Nigeria, and National Open University was not really established. It was still National Open University. But National uh, Nigerian Open University was the one Professor Afolabi Ojo have as the first vice chancellor, which metamorphosed into National Open University of Nigeria. So it was after that that we had the administration now put it to law. And that is why we are able to have our people now going to law school uh, to accommodate a lot of things that we are now demanding for in uh, national uh, in the national policy of education that they want us to be part and then we are because that's why I said your school is a, a national uh, is a federal university a single mode university where uh, you have all your courses accredited no cheating so whatever they are doing in uh, University of Ibadan, we are as well as doing it, uh, we are doing it here. And with integrity that nobody, no one allows you, no one help you to get your certificate. No lecturer can hide five marks for you. If you have anything with any lecturer, it is at your own uh, risk. So, like I used to tell people, if you come to a national university, 
where you have uh, you you come with your uh, you have your certificate, you are free. Nobody can say ah this lecturer has victimized me or the like we used to say when we score seventy, we say ah, I got seventy plus, I got eighty. But when uh, you score sixty or uh, when you score forty or thirty, don't mind them. They gave me thirty, not knowing that uh, this is what you have done. But by and large, uh, the the educational system we are having is synonymous to the one you are having in Nigerian universities all over. So, in other words, anything you are doing is uh, is uh, legitimate and it's as well as why bona fide Nigerian uh, student, but because we don't allow unionism and not any other things to come up, and that is why we do. Then, when you look at it, how do we, why the need for open and distance learning system? You no, know, if you look at it, in most of our institutions, like we have now students in the class, which university and the people that register for this course are 12,780 something, 85. Out of which, uh, this is almost four or five universities because the capacity of some of the universities is not up to 4,000, 5,000 at most, the whole population. So, and you alone at 100 level, 100 level students, we are having 12,000 plus. So if you have 12,000 plus, where do you want to pull them? How many of them will pass them and pass and be accommodated in the university? So that means the university we have in the country is not enough. And that is why we look at it that the current capacity of this university cannot carry them. And we cannot train them. And how many of them can we put in the normal classroom? <clears throat> when we want to teach them, how do we teach all of uh, 12,000 students? How do we teach uh, 12,000 students? Do you want to go and put them in the air or you want to go and put them uh, in a hall where they will stampede into each other? And then, so that is one of the essence of uh, this. And because people are demanding, people are yearning for higher education, people want to read, people who are staying in their work, they don't want to lose their job. At the same time, they want to. Uh, they want to be in a university. And let me tell you, I've said it once and I will repeat it here, that most people, most people in Nigeria today, uh, uh, most uh, employer, uh, uh, employers, they will tell you, uh, if, if you bring another certificate from, uh, uh, other than certificate, uh, when, you are in, when you are working, when you're on the job, some will not, will not take it and they'll stop taking it because they know that uh, as you are working, one, one way or the other, you will bribe your lecturer. Only area where you have access with your lecturer is when you have projects. And these are lecturers from other conventional universities. We are not doing it alone because there is no how, not every, all the uh, study centers, we have uh, this, uh, we have uh, our lecturers. So, Lecturers from other universities in the neighboring place, the close up uh, uh, lecturers to you will be assigned to you to supervise your project. Whereby that is when you have contacts. OEM and OEKU uh, signer. <clears throat> be careful. You still want me to talk. So that is when you have contact with your lecturer. So, uh, so people are hanging for higher, higher education. How do we get this certificate? And you cannot eat your cake and have it. But this time around, you can eat your cake and have it. It's simple. Come to National Open University, and you will be you, you will be on your job. And then at the same time, you'll be learning quality education, not uh, this thing. Some of you, as time goes on, will see some uh, some are backing out because I can remember in the la uh, in the last presentation I did. Uh, I was able to censor why people are running away from National Open University. Some people confessed to me when I went to some centers. They were telling me that, ah, 
and we are there nobody that can assist us you know because i interact freely and some of them thought i'm i'm a student too so during that time i was able to get that uh, okay because we don't have contact with lecturers that is why some of them are running away no lecturer to bribe no, no, like, because you don't know where your paper will be marked you don't know who will mark your paper it's more or less like why it's more or less like why because you uh Except that you are taught somebody was dictating for you in your center, and nobody is going to do that because we don't have we don't allow all those lecturers to come and vigilate. It is your at your center they will vigilate you, and once you are caught, we have a, a server a camera that cut across our, uh, all the centers, whereby once you look back, we we'll know you. So if you are uh, they, you are caught physically. They will go and check the camera. Is it true that uh, that person was caught? Or uh, that uh, person is not humiliating that person? They will verify. Before you know it, we have all of them. They will say, okay, aha, these people, definitely, uh, you have a case with him. He or her will be, uh, will be sent, sent away. So, my dear brothers and sisters, this is one of the reasons why we have it. The low capacity, because um, most of the university cannot take it. Even university of your choice, you cannot go there. But here you can have it in your house, close to you. Some of you will see 30 centers. As well. The essence of this university is to establish it in every local government, in all the local government in Nigeria, so that you have it, not that uh, somebody, and you still have the same quality of education. Like we are teaching you here now. Some of you are in Aba, some of you are in uh, Kalaba, uh, Saria, Maduguri, Lagos, Ijebode, uh, or uh, Bini. So you are all over, and yet you are receiving facilitation. So need for lifelong. You no, know, uh, there are some people that come for liberty. Education liberates people. People have education. To say that ah well, don't let just let me just uh, let me while away time by going to school, like what uh, Obas George did. He needs for lifelong education. And he has become a president. He doesn't need it again. But he find it he, he find it uh, easy. Like ah, uh, what am I? Let people call me doctor. Let people call me PhD. That you sir, you are well. God will catch you. So well, let me have uh, this education. Let me show it to my uh, student and uh, my uh, my uh, my children that I'm a PhD holder. So what are the characteristics of open and distance learning? Uh, we have talked about it uh, times and times and times. So now we said it's easy access. Like I said, it is meant to be built uh, to be built or to be uh, to be state in every local government of across the state. So the one we have in the uh, center and uh, the, the state capital is what we call the state owned capital is the, uh, the state owner. Then the other ones are community centers. So people, some community young for it to say, let our people, we want to liberate our people, let them go so that they can have access to education. Then, one, two, physical separation of learner and teachers. I've said it oh, times. Uh, and in fact, I've got, there is no time I did not mention it. Use of interactive telecommunication. You can see it is, uh, we are using it both ways. If not for the rubbish you people are doing on this, this we, uh, we should have opened up and then we'll be hearing ourselves. Some of you I will want to, want to participate and then uh, interact. And that was how I normally do my things. Because every class I have, I want my student to make contribution. It will be, uh, uh, it should not be a uh, teacher center. It should be student center. Whereby, and that is where you get more. Because from what you're doing, uh, what other ones are saying, you, you derive points from there than what the lecturer is giving. Because yes, he too will have another point. So, 
uh, collaborate with what I'm saying, and we'll be able to learn better. But we didn't allow that. So instead, you create a lot of problems. You want to uh, do this. You want to have your children. I'm so, so sorry. So uh, that is how you want it. Then external base, you can see, and that is why it is called university. Any open and distance learning that uh, you have, uh, you go to, uh, you don't have. You know, people look for shift, uh, shift things now. I learned that some people are even, uh, they have been, uh, people have cajoled them to collect money from them, saying, one University of Ghana is in Nigeria. It's a lie. If you know you want to read uh, from a university, go to National Open University or go to all other uh, open and distance learning, University of Ibadan, University of Lagos, University of Maiduguri, Uni Abuja. We have them all over. The sharing of learning experience, just like we are doing now. We are sharing our learning experience that we have. So, in other words, we we are uh, we are kind of openness. We are open to ideas. We are open to time. We are open to space because we don't have barrier. In openness, we are open to everybody, irrespective of your age, your uh, your tribe, your distance. So, when we normally have our meetings, we we pray now style. And what is now style? National. Everybody pray in his own way of belief. In respect of your religion, your tribe, your whatever. If you still believe in uh, tradition, you pray. You pray. Who does somewhere? Who does somewhere? Hmm. I'm, I'm shouting. Some people are still doing this uh, nonsense. Can they call themselves to order? Must you allow your name to be mentioned? The old world is hearing you. Tomorrow, maybe one of your children will read, read it from an archive. You say, ah, Daddy, you are, uh, you, I, I heard your name. Where they said you are disturbing in the class. I think that will be that will be honor to you. And you'll be able to, you'll not be able to bury your shape there. So it's open to, in respect, in respect of your age, your caliber, your level, your your status, your place of work is open to everyone who yearn for or who cares to have uh, education. So, because there is no how I will not uh, try and uh, allow you people. You can meet yourself and then ask your question now. Yes. Uh, uh, I want to ask the links why are they not working? The, the links are working. The links are working. I don't know what happened with your this thing. The links are working. NG Mary. Oh, so when our exam starting? Well, uh, uh, pen on paper is starting in October. October, October maybe 20 or 23. So, but then, you, why are you bothering with yourself with the uh, uh, time of exam? Let's finish. Uh, that is too close. To this. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, this thing we don't have. Uh, E-exam e will not start until, uh, until around November. E-exam okay, will start sir. November. I don't okay, to sir. December time. Okay. So. Hello, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Yes. Please, sir, yes, my uh, name is sir. Mary. Yes, sir. Um, oh, yeah, talk. <laughs> if you are not Hello. talking, yes, sir, you are in trouble. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Let me hear you. Good afternoon, uh, sir. Talk. Good, Good afternoon. afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, I can hear you. I'll meet yourself and talk. So I just want to greet Hello, you. Sir. I don't have anything Hello, to sir. say. Hello, sir. Okay, thank you. I have I don't Hello, work sir. to do. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Yes. Hello, sir. Yes, I'm going to ask you a question. 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 Yes, I'm going to 
Yes, I let you see. Uh, that you are not listening well. He what said, I said that that is, is, is John face. It's a uni. It's it's house in university. You are doing. Uh, it's, not, it's not in the mushroom. It's not in the uh, mushroom. So it is housed by a university, and that university is accredited yeah, by a. Do you get this? Okay, sir. Yes, I'll sir. Be lying. Thank you, sir. I'll Hello, be sir. Lying. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Okay, Hello, sir. Talk. Oh, Hello, talk. sir. Good afternoon, oh, sir. Good evening, 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 Magali, I'm just I'm just joining you. Your... Mm -hmm. You are just joining I'm... the class. Yes, I'm just joining. I'm just joining the class. I will, I will send it to your portal. You get it uh, from uh, the link. Nani, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. I'm just making a lot of noise. Good afternoon, sir. Good evening, sir. Can you people just raise hand before you ask questions? This is class for God's sake. Why not wait for your name to be called now before answering? Mute everybody. Mute everybody. Mute everybody. I beg. Please just mute everyone, sir. If you want to talk, raise your hand. I mute everybody. Well, uh, I still believe that uh, we are we are still not. Uh, that's why I said, when you want to talk, you raise up your hand, and let me see you. Ah, uh, then I called I called you, so that we can. Uh, yeah. So, uh, Adamu Abdullah, you want to talk? Adamu uh, Abdullah. Abdullah, I will only allow Abdullah to talk now. So, yes, let me hear you. Abdullah Umaru, Maurice, are you there? You can meet yourself. Commit yourself and talk. Abdullah Maurice. Oga in English. Okay. Uh, Irene. If Abdullah is not talking, Irene, can you talk? All of you are just raising up your hand. Do you want to talk? Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Who is that? Henry. 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 Henry, Henry Wokolo. Yes, sir. Okay. Let me hear you. Uh, what uh, I want to ask one, somebody has asked part of it about pen and paper. You said? Uh, I said what I want to ask. Somebody has asked part of the uh, question, which is pen and paper, which is beginning on 24th, according to what you said of next month. I wanted to say that if the real exam is starting or commencing, next month that would have loved the senate because if it is openness as you said that we welcome suggestions and all that it would have been better for this 
would have been better for the school to look into that. Well done. Because most most uh, students are trying to finish it. I'll be like. Hello, good afternoon. Sir. Whoa. Because sir, most students are trying to find their feet. And they have not, they are not stable yet. And the next thing is exam. Hello, good Se secondly, secondly, what I want to ask you, uh, say is that I've been trying to assess the past videos. And they are requesting for passport. So I don't know which is the passport they are asking for. I mean, to watch the past facilitation yeah, passport. You have your passport. This is a market square or a classroom. Yeah, sir, please, sir, lecturer, sir, can you, you just lecturer? Can, can you put this class? Let Let's only hear the question from the questioner, please. Please, everybody, please, 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 the market, please, sir. Please, yes, yes, I have a question. Yes, sir. Raise your hand. Yes, sir. Raise your hand. Unmute everybody and unmute everybody, please. Good Good answer, everybody, sir. Sir. This classroom. You say no. I, have wow. question, I have a question. Are you I have a already? question. <laughs> Who called you that? Uh, Wokolo, let me answer you quickly. Uh, you see, uh, in every in a, in every place, in every uh, organization, there is always a rule. Okay. For the fact that we said is openness, I've told you we have uh, four or five major ways we can learn through, and we are starting pen on paper. Pen on paper is meant for people who are three hundred level up to uh, postgraduate and the rest. So you are not starting yet. You are starting your own in November. You still have ample time. And this, uh, this uh, facilitation has commenced since August. But for the fact that some people did not register on time and they didn't come up, we can't just be doing it. Just as you said, some people are getting to find their feet. Some people will still join tomorrow and they will be looking, they want to find their feet. So if uh, we, we should start doing that, definitely we'll be considering everybody that is coming in, one after the other, one after the other. Then when are we going to write the exam? Till eternity. Just like I said, all of you should mute yourself. Let me hear. I'm start calling you to answer. Everybody want to talk. Well, you tell me who is at fault. If I butchered you, I... you are not talking. Tell me who is at fault. Because you people did not give room for it. You are the one challenging yourself. You are the one causing the problem for yourself. And that is what is happening in conventional universities. Too. They will come for class, so people will not attend. And you don't, and now you are making an excuse to say when it's if it's openness. What is because it's openness now? We should group it to insanity because you are making case for yourself now. Others have been listening to it and uh, been able to have it uh, recorded. Uh, so as for your distance, for passcode or what have you, I've been telling you, always move closer to the ICT person in your area, in your, in your locality, in the school where the, you are you registered. You have a study center. This study center is not just meant, there, meant to be there. Go to the ICTs where you have any challenges. They will tell you what to do, and they are there and they are paid to serve you. Please eh, exploit that. Don't uh, shy away from what you're supposed to have done. So, I'm going to listen to these people uh, in order of how I'm going to call them now. Yusuf Ali, number one. Uto Samuel Loko, number two. Salako Shitu, number three. Abdullah, you are not going to talk again. You have lost your chance. Samuel Happiness, number four, and Oluda Refemi Samuel, number five. Then let's see how it goes so that uh, we can we can leave and then if you allow for these things to come up, fine. If you don't, well. Now, Yusuf Aliu, can we have you very quickly? 
Oh, mute yourself and talk. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Good, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, yes. Please, I just want to ask, this is my first time to, uh, this is my first time uh -huh. to join the uh -huh. what so can my, my question is that most of the tests that we, we did, yes, sir, I want to ask a question about the test, the TME, sir. The TME. Hello, I don't, sir. I don't, I, yes, I yes, don't sir. have power. I don't have any power over TME. No, I just want to ask, there's a question. I just want to ask a general question about the TME. Okay, okay. okay so most of ahead. us that we have been trying, this is my first time to join this class, sir. So most of our okay. most of the tests have already done most tests. Most of the time you are trying to do the test. The, the network will just go by the time you click on the finish here on the system, it will just bring the distance comes. So I now ask the question that I didn't know maybe it's a shopper or it's from the the, the management. I didn't understand. Sometimes if you submit, we we'll just bring the grade form. Well, once you submit, that is your score. Yes. Well, once you okay. submit, the computer will mark it. And that is why we call it tutor mark assignment. Okay. Okay, sir. Uh, tutor mark assignment. So, we have uh, Salako. Uh, Salako. Oh, that is my dad, Lola. Oh, yeah, are you talking? Oh, yeah, Salako City. Or meet yourself and talk. Who is ready among those people that? Eh, okay, Emmanuel. Oh, yeah. Let's hear you, Emmanuel. Edit. The time is fast paced. Good afternoon, sir. Uh, good afternoon. Very quickly, talk now. Who is ready to talk? Good afternoon, sir. Yeah. I'm 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 I'll put yourself yes, on top. Okay, okay I'm glad. Good afternoon, sir. I'm, 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 I'm glad, yeah. One at a time. I have a question, sir. My question is that why are we starting POP before E exam? You don't think concern you or to get or to get to three hundred level. You don't you don't have anything to do with that. Are you are you are you three hundred level? I've, I've just explained that now. That means you are not listening. I said you people still have ample time. That your your own exam will start by November. What do you so want the to do November when? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so sorry. Okay, sir. I have a question. I have a question, sir. Sorry, sir. We finish POP. Oh yeah. Ask I have a question, sir. What you have thought here? It's not about you. Oh yeah. Ask your question. <laughs> Sir, I want to say something concerning about the the people are finding it difficult to join this class. I don't know if uh, you can, hello, sir, you can try as much as possible whenever the class commence to deactivate the waiting room. That, the, that the, means, the, the waiting yes. room is, is really hello, disturbing. Hello, 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 yes, sir. Hello, hello. I've, I've talked about it in the first class that uh, before now, before now, we accommodate a lot of uh, students. But because the students joined from nowhere, they started leaving. So we limited this, uh, we limited this to fewer number of people. But now I've talked to them in the management uh, at the management level and they have assured me that very soon they will be school. Every student will be able to join at when uh, at appropriate time. All right, sir. Uh, the second, the second uh, point. My second point is this, sir. So sorry about that, and that is why you have the second authority that you can get it from the uh, you can get it from our uh, from your quarter. 
All right, sir. So, the, the, my second point of view is this. Uh, according to my portal I'm seeing here, um, the dashboard here, I'm seeing GST 1070 next month on the 10th. So I don't know if you can help us talk to the school IT to, to rectify that. Because we are seeing GST, I'm seeing GST 1070 next month, which is not actually right. It's the same thing too. Yes, uh, you are seeing... most of all, it's like... Um, this, this one. One. <laughs> So temporarily, I will, I will do it and go and delete all those courses. Eh? Anyone you FGJ find out... Yes, me too, it's the same thing, guys. Are, yeah. are, you, are you not in the classes? I've, 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 we have talked about this thing from the session of this uh, lesson. I don't know why you are bringing it up again. I thought you people are... The worst thing is that they are not even asking questions. They are just bringing up different, different questions. Exactly. exactly. What you're supposed to ask questions on, you should not ask. So, exactly. Okay. Hello, we, we, meet, we meet on Saturday. God bless you. What time, sir?